Wednesday afternoon here on Quixie 98.3, which means it's time for Forever Friends. That's our weekly segment where we feature cats and dogs that are looking for new forever home. Uh, and we do that with the help of the animal shelter. In the last couple of weeks, Mike's been away on vacation, taking a much-needed break. But now he's back. Hello. Hello. Hey. How are you? <laughs> it's good to see you, I Mike. missed you. I missed you, buddy. I did, too. It was, you know, I don't mind doing it on my own, but it's just it's just different. Yeah. You know, no. we... Uh, we, we've got uh, a, a good relationship here. And, yes. <laughs> and karma. Or, no, it's not karma. I don't know what you call it. But uh, yin and yang, so to speak. I guess, so. Camaraderie. Yeah. It's something, something to that effect. <laughs> well, And to give everybody an update because, you know, I, I talk about how wonderful this community is, especially to the animal shelter every time. And, and stuff like this shows how wonderful they are. You know, we were packed for space um, the other day, and we started uh, – uh, during our Clear the Kennel special we had during the last two weeks of June, we did a total of 71 adoptions. 27 of those were larger dogs. Wow. Which is amazing. You know, I can't thank the community enough. Um, it's all about saving lives, and that's exactly what this community did and what the shelter did, and, and uh, I'm just thankful for everything that happened for that. Um, we had a lot of really good people come in the door to help us. And, I mean, it just it makes it all worthwhile. You know sure. what I'm saying? It just really does. So, But to get to our cute and fluffy for the day, <laughs> can't ha- go anywhere without the cute and fluffy. Uh, this week we have Apple. Apple is a nine-week-old spayed female with brown tiger striped fur. She is very active and will do best in a home with lots of toys and a playmate. Apple's been in the shelter care or since early June and is ready for her forever home. She's a very cute kitten. She is. She you, is. You're, you're really trying hard today. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, I, I try to give the public what they want. <laughs> uh, our dog for this week is Cashew. Cashew is a one-year-old red and white pit healer mix. He gets along with other dogs and has energy to spare. If you're looking for a trail companion, he's the guy for you. Cashew's been at the shelter for 100 days waiting to find his new family. And he's very patriotic, too. Yes, he is. Yes. <laughs> there you go. I like that. Picture. We aim to please. Yes. <laughs> um, of course, we always want to know the numbers. We have uh, talked about 422 pets, and we have adopted out 418 of those pets. Hey, we're still making up ground. <laughs> we're, do- we're doing it. We're getting her done. And it's that time of year again, a very special time for the shelter and for Friends of Hardin County Animal Shelter, the Dirty Dog Bash, uh, hosted by Jeff and Mary Key. It's going to be catered by Southern Flair with Chef Brandy Catering. Um, Entertainment by Van Winkle. It's a live and silent auction. It's going to be Saturday, August 6th of 2022. Get your tickets now before they're gone. You can get them online. Go to the Focus uh, website. If I know you've been to it, it is uh, it's just an amazing event to go to. It is different from the other animal venues that I've been to because it's down home. Um, I mean, you're in a stable. <laughs> yeah, but it's beautiful. Everything yes. about it is beautiful. I, I just I can't say enough about it. And Jeff and Mary Key, like we I say this all the time. Great people. Once you meet them. It, it's like you've always known them. They're your family. You're, you're, you want to do stuff for them. And, of co- and you know, Jeff will be the first one. At, oh, you need something to drink? And, and you know, you, yes. you don't realize um, where you're at until you're there. And it's just a wonderful event. And it, all the proceeds go to help the animals at the shelter and to help focus do all the programs that they do. Sure. Uh, they do a lot of uh, rescue transfer transfers for us on Fridays. They have a van and they drive them to different locations. A lot of people don't know we have a lot of animals that go to different states and to different countries. We have a, a Canadian rescue that we work with as well. I did not. I did not know that. So, of course, if you have any questions about the animals that we we talked about, you can call us two seven zero seven six nine three four two eight. Stop by and see us. Two hundred twenty Peterson Drive. We're there Monday through Saturday, twelve to four. Um, of course, you can look, it up, look us up on Facebook, Hardin County uh, Animal Shelter KY, and make sure you put the KY in there because there's a Hardin County, Tennessee, and a Hardin County, Texas, I believe. And we've got calls from both about stray animals, people mad because we didn't come out. And I'm like, <laughs> he's on his way. It's going to be a few hours, days. <laughs> so, um, of course, you can look us up on the county website at hcky.org. 
you can go there to purchase your, uh, your license for your dog, and you can also make a donation to help care for the animals at the shelter. Of course, all of our adoptable animals are featured on PetFinder.com. Uh, and again, please remember Dirty Dog Bash, Saturday, April, August 6, 2022. Please go online, buy your tickets. There's only 200 available. It's a wonderful event. Please come out and see us. Yeah, you don't, you don't want to miss it. No, if, you, if, if you've not been, it's, it's great people, and not just Jeff and Mary Key. They're great, but all the people that come out are, are fantastic. It's great food. Uh, they've always had great food, be it whoever's catering, and uh, they always have great entertainment. So Absolutely. It's, Absolutely. Just a, it's really a good event. Yeah. All right, that is Forever Friends for this week, brought to you by our friends Pet Supplies Plus on Town Drive in Elizabethtown.